Hey Royals, welcome back to my channel. I am Kiana, owner and founder of Royal Breakthrough Hair and Beauty and the creator of the Royal Breakthrough Hair Care line. And on this channel, we focus on natural hair and how to properly care for your natural hair. That way it's growing to its fullest potential. Now on today's video, I'm going to be teaching you how to cornrow your natural hair for beginners because cornrowing is the foundation to any protective hairstyle, whether it's wigs, crochet braids, feed-in braids, corn rowing is the basics to natural hair and that's why I included it into this series. This is episode 6 of the basics to natural hair series and if you are interested in learning how to corn roll your natural hair, stay tuned. First thing you're going to do is detangle the area in which you'll be braiding, that way the braiding process is easy and smooth. Then you're going to separate a small portion of the hair, which is how you'll start the braid. You can do this with a comb or your fingers. Now we're going to take that small section and separate it into three equal strands. Like so. All right, now with corn rolling, we're gonna always go underneath that middle strand to grab the left strand. Now the middle strand always interchanges with the strand that you're grabbing. So if I'm using my right hand to go underneath the middle and grab the left strand, my middle now becomes the left strand. And the same with the right, when I go underneath the middle strand to grab the right, the middle strand then becomes the right strand. And we're gonna continue the process, but you'll get it as we go through the process and you're able to see it. So I'm gonna start with the right strand because I am right-handed. And I'm going to go underneath. I'm gonna take my pointer finger and go underneath the middle strand grabbing that left strand with my pointer finger and my thumb, then letting go. Now, like I said, that middle strand now becomes the left strand. And we're gonna take that newfound left strand and go underneath the middle strand, which used to be the left strand, and grab the right strand with my pointer finger and thumb. Now this time when I grab the right strand with my pointer finger and thumb, I'm gonna pick up some hair, also put that in between my pointer finger and thumb, and I'm gonna continue the process. I'm gonna grab the right strand, go underneath that middle strand, and grab the left with my pointer and thumb, pick up some hair, and continue. Grab that left strand, go underneath the middle strand, grab the right, and pick up some hair. Take the right strand, go under that middle strand, grab that left strand, and pick up some hair. Gonna take that left strand, go underneath the middle strand, grab that right strand, and pick up some hair. And we're gonna keep doing that all the way down. Picking up the hair is the technique that connects the braid to the scalp. It's that difference between a single individual braid and a cornrow because you are picking up little pieces of hair as you go. You take that right strand, go underneath the middle strand, grab that left strand, and pick up some hair. 
And I'm going to continue to repeat this technique out loud because I am aware that some people are visual learners and some people are auditory learners. So if you are braiding along with this video and you're not looking at the screen, you can at least hear my voice and hear the technique. I'm going to take that left strand, go underneath the middle strand, grab that right strand with your pointer and thumb finger and pick up the hair and put, also put that between your pointer and thumb. Grab that right strand, go underneath the middle. Grab the left strand and pick up some hair. Take that left strand, go underneath the middle. Grab that right strand and pick up some hair. Take that right strand, go underneath that middle. Grab the left strand and pick up some hair. And as you can see, the braid is almost coming to an end. You're just going to continue with that pattern. Underneath the middle, grab that left strand and pick up some hair. Take that left strand, go underneath the middle, grab that right strand and pick up some hair. All right, so I'm gonna go from this position to this position with my fingers. Let's go from that position to this position, and now we are going to just braid the hair as you would a single individual braid. All right, so that first braid is completed. Now, I'm going to just do it one more time to make sure that everybody gets the technique, gets that pattern. This time I won't talk so much. I'll kind of let the music play. But I'm not going to speed up the video because I want you to get the technique. So you're going to comb out that section again. Make sure that it is detangled. That is always the first step. going to section off our small piece and we're going to begin with the cornrow. So like we said at the beginning, we separate three equal strands. Just like so. I start with my right hand but feel free to start with whatever side you like. I'm going to take my right strand and go underneath the middle strand to grab that left strand. I'm going to take that strand that's not grabbed, go underneath the newfound middle strand and grab that right strand, pick up some hair and continue. Take that right strand, go underneath the middle, grab the left strand with your pointer finger and thumb and pick up some hair. Take that left strand, go underneath the middle, grab the right with your pointer finger and thumb and pick up some hair. And you want to, here and there, make sure you're completely combing through the hair with your fingers to make sure that there's no tangles, there's no knots. So that way you're able to complete the braid without any interruptions. Take that right strand, go underneath the middle strand, grab that left strand with your pointer finger and thumb, grab some hair. Take the left strand, go underneath the middle, grab the right strand, pick up some hair, 
and continue. And you just keep going with that same technique until you get towards the end of the hair. And then you switch the position of your fingers to complete the braid as you would a single individual braid. All right, at this point in the video, I'm going to go ahead and play some music. I'm not going to speed up this video just to ensure that you understand the technique that I have taught today. If you felt that this video was helpful, definitely leave a like and share with a family member or friend that you feel can also benefit from this video. This is episode six to the series Basics to Natural Hair. I am Kiana. Thank you for watching and Royals continue to break through full force until next time y'all be great